Hi everyone, welcome to my classroom, Structural Analysis 2. Hi, this is Lakshmi, Assistant Professor, Department of Civil Engineering, SNIT, Adur. Module 4, Canis Method. Today's topic, Introduction of Canis Method. In this module, Canis Method. Canis method developed by Casper Cani. Okay. The Canis method developed by Casper Cani is a, a German one, German person, Casper Cani. Actually, uh, this method, uh, this uh, Canis method, K A N I, Cani, Canis, Canis method. This method, actually, this method is an extension of this method is an extension of slope deflection method. Okay. This method is an extension of slope deflection method. Uh, this Canis method is developed by Casper Canny, and this is an extension of slope deflection method. Okay, then Canis method derivation. Derivation. Okay, let's see the derivation. Consider A B span span a b of a continuous structure okay consider a span a b of a continuous structure okay and this is the loading suppose here a point load and w and a udl w per meter run okay and this is the loading diagram and uh, the deformed deformed shape of this member a b is like this Okay, this is A, this is B, deformed shape of the member A, B like this. Okay. M, A, B and this is M, B, A and this is and the end A and B, end A and B. This is end A and this is end B. A and B undergoes rotation, okay. At A, it is theta A and at B, it is theta B, okay. A, it is theta, okay, it's not clear, theta A and at B, end B, the rotation theta B. Okay, and there is no lateral displacement of the end. Okay, there is no, sorry, the lateral displacement of the ends do not occur. Okay, then uh, MAB and MBA, what is MAB and MBA? Uh, yeah, it is the end moments for the span AB, span AB. Okay, this is the end moment MAB and MBA. These are the end moments and then comes to the sine Convention. Okay, sign convention. First, clockwise take clockwise n moments are positive. That is, anti-clockwise n moments are negative. Second one is clockwise rotations. Clockwise rotations at the ends, this and this, rotations at the ends are positive. Okay, these are the sign conventions. Take clockwise, end moments are positive. That means anti-clockwise end moments are negative. And second one, clockwise rotations at the ends are positive. That means anti-clockwise rotations take it as negative. Then the derivation, detailed derivation here, consider a span AB. Okay. The moments are determined. The moments are determined by the following steps. The moments 
are determined by the following steps or stages okay and mab and mba first step okay step 1 this is the b a b of a continuous structure okay this is m a b and this is m b a okay and this is the rotation theta a and theta b okay these are the loads point load and the udl w and w per mid okay is simply supported suppose that is simply supported step one we have to find out the moments okay the moments are determined by the following stages first stage or first step the end a and b end a and b okay a and b of the member the end a and b of the member First, regard as fixed, okay? The member AB, the end A and B of the member AB is considered, first considered as fixed. Okay, first considered as fixed. Okay, it is similar to slope deflection method, okay? In slope deflection method, the first step is consider and A and B are fixed. Here in Canis method also, first consider the end A and B as fixed. Okay. Then, M bar AB. Okay. This is M bar AB and this is M bar B A. M bar A B and M bar B A are the fixed end moments. Okay. First of all, consider end A and B as fixed and find out the fixed end moments M bar A B and M bar B A. Clear? Okay. Second step. Okay. The ends A and B of the member are first considered as fixed. Okay. Fixed end moments are M bar AB and M bar BA. Second, release, release the fixity at A and Maintained the fixity at B. Okay. Step 2. Release the fixity at A and maintain the fixity at B. Okay. Okay. Maintain the fixity at B and release the fixity at A. Okay. Fixity at A. Release the fixity at A. And maintain the fixity at B. Okay. The end A is rotated through an angle theta. Okay. The end A is rotated to an angle theta. It's clear. This is theta A. Okay, and here the end A is rotated through an angle theta by the application of a moment. Here, what's the moment? 4EI, 4EI, theta A by L. Here, take 4EI, theta A by L as 2M dash AB. Okay, 2M dash AB. AB and here 
transfer the 50 percentage of this that is m dash a b clear okay step two in step two what is step two release the fixity at a and maintaining maintaining the fixity at b at the end b okay step 2 release the fixity at a and maintain the fixity at b and here the rotation theta a for the rotation the application of a moment 2 m dash a b 2 m dash a b means phi theta a by l okay and here at a 2 m dash a b and transfer the 50 percentage of this moment through the far end to the far end far end is a b it is m dash a b okay the moment m dash a b is called the moment m dash the moment m dash a b is called the rotation contribution called rotation contribution of the of the end a of the end a okay m dash a b is called this one m dash a b m dash a b is called rotation contribution of the end a okay and next step three okay step three maintain the fixity at a and release the fixity at b maintain the fixity at a okay and release the fixity at b okay the end a is considered as fixed and end b is rotated it is rotated through an ankle theta b okay theta b the end b is rotated rotated through an ankle theta b by the application of a moment by the application of a moment yeah 2 m dash b a 2 m dash b a 2 m dash b a by the application of a moment 2 m dash b a at b okay okay this is 2 m dash b a okay and the end b is rotated through an ankle theta b by the application of a moment 2 m dash b a and transfer this to this okay here it is half transferring 50 percentage of 2 m dash b a and it is m dash b a here the m dash the moment okay in step 3 the end a is or maintain at end a is fixed and release the fixity at b okay and the moment this moment moment m dash b a is called rotation contribution of the end b okay m dash b a is called the rotation contribution of the end b clear The final, final moments M A B and M B A can be expressed as M A B equal to here. Okay, the left side M bar A B sum of this three M bar A B plus m bar a b plus 
to m dash a b plus m dash b a then m b a equal to right side m bar b a plus m dash a b plus 2 m dash b a this is the final moment and this is the equation okay and the derivation first we consider a span ab of a continuous beam okay and this is a span ab and this is the loading okay loading figure first step first step and a and b of the member are first considered as fixed and find out the fixed end moments step 2 release the fixity at a and maintain the fixity at b and a is rotated at an angle theta a by the application of a moment 2 m dash ab okay 2 m dash ab means 4 ei theta a by l and 50% transfer to the far end b that is m dash ab where m dash ab is the rotation contribution of a of the end a and in step 3 the end a is fixed and end b is okay release the fixity of b and a is fixed and release the fixity at b okay and b the end b is rotated okay rotated at an angle theta b by the application of moment 2 m dash b a okay transfer the moment to 50 percentage to far end a that is m dash b a where m dash b a is the rotation contribution at end b of the end b then comes to the final moment m a b and m b a is the summation of left side and m b a is the summation of right side that is m bar a b plus 2 m dash a b plus m dash b a and m b a equal to m bar b a plus m dash a b plus 2 m dash b a okay this is the moment of a member this is the moment of a member moment of a member is the moment of a member a b is the member okay here a b is the member m a b m a b okay the moment of a member is the summation of these three okay summation of fixed end moments at the near end plus due to the loading okay fixed end moments at the near end due to fixed end moments bar a b is the summation of fixed end moments plus what is this 2 m dash a b twice 2 m dash a b twice the rotation contribution of near end a b near end twice twice the rotation contribution of near end plus m bar b m dash b a what is m dash b a rotation contribution of the far end rotation contribution of far end far end means b a say similarly m b a fixed end moments fixed end moments plus m dash a b rotation contribution of far end plus twice the rotation contribution of near end this is the summation okay clear